Hey, Sam here from Sonic, and in this quick video, I'm going to talk about a brand new feature that lets you connect your Sonic account with your WordPress.org self-hosted site and then lets you post any content that you generate on Sonic to WordPress in just one click. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So I'll first of all go over to my WordPress site. You might be pretty familiar with this interface if you have used WordPress before. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to head over to this plugin section in the sidebar and then I'm going to click on add new. Now this will load up the WordPress plugins marketplace. So I'm just going to this search bar over here and then I'm going to search for Sonic. This will bring up the Sonic plugin for WordPress. All you need to do is just click install now. All right, so that has been installed now. Um, now we just need to click this activate button to activate the plugin. Awesome. Now, again on the sidebar, if you see there's an item there called settings. So we are just going to hover over that and that will load up this menu on the right hand side. So I'm just going to click on right Sonic here. All right, so this is what the connection page uh, of the plugin looks like. Now what I'm going to do is just click this connect button over here and this will redirect us to right Sonic. Now you'll see this authorization page. It is uh, asking us to authorize WordPress to access our data. I'm just going to click on approve here. And as soon as you click approve, you'll see this message at the top right hand corner saying successfully connected to WordPress. Cool, so WordPress has been connected now. Just to verify this, what you can also do is you can click on your profile image over here. This will load up the sidebar and now you can click on the integrations tab. And then this will load up the integrations page. So if the WordPress.org account has been successfully connected with your Sonic account, then it should say plugin install over here and then you're basically good to go. Now I'll just go back to the home page and just go to an article that I generated before. So for example, I'm just going to load this article, the most recent one essentially, from my history. So I'm just going to click on that. What you can also do is, you know, obviously you can kind of generate a new article and then do, do this step. But for now, just to save some time, um, I have just loaded an article that I previously generated. Now. If you see, there's a new WordPress icon over here, so this gray icon. All you need to do to post this article to your WordPress site is you just click that button. So you click that, takes like a couple of seconds, and then it automatically publishes it to your WordPress site. To view the published article, all I need to do is click the click here button. So I just click that, and this loads my published WordPress blog post. So as you can see, the title has been copied over. We have the image as well. We have the caption for the image. And then we have our intro paragraph and then the rest of the article. So we have our subheadings, our different paragraphs and sections within the article. And then we have our conclusion piece over here. So yeah, the WordPress plugin that um, you just installed, it parses all the data that we take from Sonic, We clean it up and then we basically push it to your WordPress site so you don't have to manually copy and paste. So this saves you a lot of time. You can churn out content very quickly and then publish it from the same place. So right from within Sonic, you can both generate and publish content. Saves you a ton of time, saves you a ton of money, and we hope you like this feature. If you have any other feature requests, feel free to reach out to me at sam at writesonic.com. We will definitely add it to our roadmap and try to bring it to you as soon as possible. Until then, thanks for watching and stay connected. Thank you very much.